This is the Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is a multi-lock brand model TSR25 round body padlock. It was sent to me by Martin in Tempe, Arizona, and I was going to put it aside because I already featured one of these in video number 537. That was about four years ago. Then I noticed that it has a different core. This one has a multi-lock junior as opposed to this multi-lock interactive, and the case is also a little bit different. So I decided to see what the new ones are like. I should note that I'm a bit out of practice on multi-locks, but the juniors usually aren't that bad. There are only four pin and pin chambers, so eight pins total. Let's see what we can do with this. Okay, I'm using this thick Z-bar as a turning tool and this multi-pick dimple flag. We're gonna start on the outer pins, nothing on one, two, okay, three is binding tightly. Nice click on the outer pin on three, nothing on four, back to the beginning. Little click on one, outer pin on two is binding. Nice click there, nothing on three. Okay, outer pin on four is binding. Nice click there and a little bit of movement on the core. Let's go back to the beginning. Looking at inner pins now. I think we got a little click on one. Nice click on two. Nice click on three, little bit of movement on the core. And little, maybe something on four, not sure there. Got a lot of movement on the core, so probably just an inner driver pin holding us up. And I did not find it on the first pass through. There we go, it's on number one, and we got this open. Put up a little bit more of a fight than I was expecting, though some of that can probably be chalked up to me being out of practice. Now, let's go ahead and take this apart and we'll take a look at the pins. To disassemble this, we can start by removing that screw down the shackle hole. It is just a normal Phillips screw. Here's the core, covered in a fair bit of grease. Let's remove this C-clip on the back. Then I'm going to use the key and a follower to remove the plug. Okay, we can start by removing the key pins. You can see there are four pin-in-pin -pin chambers, an outer and inner pin. Okay, that's not coming out too easily. Let's see if I can coax that with a pick. Part of the problem is all the grease on here. It's making everything a bit sticky. There's the first, second, third, and fourth. And let's see if we can get those inner pins out. Now we can go for the driver pins.
Okay, we can look at these pin in pin drivers. You can see there's a little bit of spooling on the inner pin, but that's it. Let's see if any of these key pins have counter milling that will catch that. And no, I don't see any. No, it doesn't look like they do. Okay, let's zoom in on that a little bit for you. Those are the pins, as I said, four pin in pin chamber, so eight pins total. Not too bad of a pick, but it's probably gonna take someone with a little bit of skill to open it up. In any case, that's all I have for you today on this multi-lock model TSR25 round body padlock. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.